Intelligent as RNA technologies presents the cellular mechanism of specific gene silencing using intelligent as RNA molecules. We are now located in the middle of target cells, in which we intend to perform RNA interference. In the extracellular space, intelligent as RNA molecules can reach both target and non-target cells. If we take a closer look at intelligent as RNA, we observe covalent bounded peptides on its backbone, preventing its degradation and avoiding the induction of RNA interference. By any available transfection method, intelligent as RNA molecules can reach the intracellular space after crossing the plasma membrane. Let us take a look at the inner part of the cell. Here we can see mitochondria, the Golgi apparatus, the smooth endoplasmic reticulum and the nucleus with the rough endoplasmic reticulum. But let us come back now to our intelligent as RNA. Here we observe that different peptides can be bonded to the S RNA backbone by linking molecules. These molecules strongly connect the S RNA to the peptide. Due to their small size, RNA interference is not affected after peptide cleavage. Using four different peptide sequences, very high cell specificity can be reached. Just after cleavage of all peptides, the intelligent as RNA becomes active to modifying gene expression. Only the target cells contain the enzymes necessary to cut off all the peptides, finally activating the intelligent as RNA. After peptide cleavage, the sRNA is now free to initiate RISC, a multi-enzyme complex which is able to separate a double-stranded RNA into two single strands, sense and antisense. Part of this complex remains on the antisense strand, searching for its complementary messenger RNA. Messenger RNAs leaving the cell nucleus are then screened for complementary regions. When this complementary region is detected, the messenger RNA is cleaved into two fragments. These fragments are finally digested by nucleases into single molecules.